Hi guys, it's Hath. I am back again and this is going to be my empties for February. I'm filming this on the second to last day of February, but there isn't anything else that I'm going to finish up, I don't think, before the 28th, tomorrow. So, anyway. Um, it is a very small collection this month. I haven't finished off a lot of stuff. I have a lot of stuff that's almost finished, but not quite finished. So, March might be a bigger month. Anyway. So, the first thing I finished off was from my Project Pan, is the Avado Avocado, Organic Avocado Oil. I was using this on my body because I don't like the smell of it, didn't want it on my face. Um, I don't notice that it did any difference, and it was really weird because it's like a greeny yellow colour, and when you rub it on your skin, your skin momentarily goes yellow, greeny yellow, weird. Um, I didn't notice any difference, I wouldn't buy it mainly because I just can't stand the smell of it um, but it was a sample so I'm glad to have that sample out of my collection I finished another packet of Swisper Cucumber Wipes you see these in almost every single one of my videos I really like them, I tend to buy them in bulk when I can um, I have another packet over there that I'm using at the moment um, then we have um, Woolworths makeup cotton pads. I don't really like these ones. I prefer the Swisper ones which are a little bit thicker and are properly bonded. These ones aren't necessarily properly bonded and you do tend to get a bit of fluff off of them occasionally which I really 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 hate. Especially if I am removing like glitter nail polish it will like just stick to the glitter and like rip off which is not ideal clearly. I finished a bath wash, shower wash, this is the Haven by Planet Earth Rose Body Wash. My mum got this bloody donkeys years ago, they don't even make this one anymore. Haven, um, Planet Earth still exists but this particular one I couldn't even find it on their website. Um, it's an Australian product apparently. Um, yeah. It was okay, it was very rose scented, it was like very much like showery in petals. Um, it was okay, it wasn't great, it wasn't terrible. I'm glad it's gone though because it was so old it was on the point of needing to be thrown out, but it wasn't off or anything, it was just really 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 old. Um, the other thing I finished was this Nivea Visage Daily Essentials Refreshing Cleansing Lotion for Normal Combination Skin. Um, it says that it removes makeup. It would remove most of my makeup and leave mascara or leave it all smeared underneath my eyes which drives me bonkers um, it was also a cream type formula and I prefer a foaming formula personally um, I wouldn't rebuy this one it wasn't that it was bad but because I didn't really like it it took me ages to use um, so I'm really glad that this one is actually now finished and can be thrown out of my collection and the last thing is another sample. This is the Aveda Tourmaline Charged Skin Refiner. Um, this came out of a Bella Books or something like that. I loved this. This was actually really, really good. Like, I don't know that I buy the, the full size because Aveda's not exactly the cheapest thing. But of all the Aveda stuff I've had, this one had one of the best, like, like, well, it didn't really smell like anything. Um, a lot of their ones, I really just don't like the scent of them. Um, they do tend to, to me, smell quite herbally, which I don't really like. Um, but this one didn't, and it, f like, it really did feel like it was, like, exfoliating properly. Um, so, yeah, if I got another sample of this, I would not be complaining. Um, I don't think I'd buy it. Not when there are other ones that are a bit cheaper to buy. But yeah, I did really, really like that one. So that's actually all of my empties. Um, I have done my usual totaling up thing. So this month I used up $26.35, which is about half what I used up last month. But anyway, um, which added to January means that in the first two months of the year I used $94.23 worth of products which is still progress it's not brilliant progress but it is still progress and stuff is moving out of my collection and um, trying not to add too much to it I will admit I actually broke my no buy uh, I did buy some stuff for myself on my gift cards but then the other night I actually broke it quite badly 
Um, but most of that was nail polish stuff. So. Anyway, guys, that's my empties for February. If you want to join me on my journey, then click down on the subscribe button down there if you haven't already. Leave me a thumbs up if you like empties videos. And leave me a comment down below because I try to respond to all comments. And I will see you in my next video. See ya.